Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna show you the component I redesigned and ask the party to print out and we'll see how it works. So I have made some improvement on the uh, components and this time I asked the PCB way to print out for me. So this is what I got from the, the package. So I actually got one of this. Oh, this are the small gift, which is nice. Hmm. And then um, I have printed out, I have uh, made um, an improvement actually on the um, uh, nozzle tips. This one, ah, okay. The packaging, the packaging is nice. It still has some of this. Ah, okay. So you can see this is the the parts that I improved. So in last video, I was uh, adding the support for the jockey nozzle. As here, it, this is a very uh, popular nozzle tips, um, which are uh, used in the pick and place mach uh, machine jobs and. This one you can see is the very small one. And then um, I have this uh, printed one as well before and um, in order to make it um, also possible to use still the printed one, I uh, optimized or I redesigned it, the nozzle tip from my side and just to be able to uh, compatible with the nozzle, the jockey nozzle as you can see here. And this is, I, uh, I got it, this time I used the third party service, I got it from the, the PCB way. And then um, when I looking at this one, the printed quality is pretty good. The, the only thing I was really um, not sure about is for um, this smallest one you see here. Um, this one, I was actually designed for 0201 components. This. And the, the, tip, the tip here is actually um, less than one millimeter and I think this is uh, uh, in my design is 0.8 and which looks uh, pretty good here and I think this the overall build quality is pretty good I, I can say and so you can see this is the the nozzle that I designed I, this one I also improved it last time just to um, mount the jockey nozzle and then you can see I can pull it out and if I use this one it's also pretty good it's actually fitted really well and then if I if I check the uh, dimensions of the jockey nozzle here you can see it's a 6.9 um then if i check on the the dimension here from the printer one it's also 6.9 which is uh, pretty good that means it's a, it's a fitting really well yeah i think i'm i'm really happy with this one so this is a uh one of the improvement i will also um uh have those uh, pre-printed parts in my website you can uh, go and have a look and I will also um, uh, put a design in my website so you can download and have a try yep this is for and also um, just for the design of this uh, nozzle tip I designed it 0201 and this one is to fit the 0201 and then this is 0402 and maybe 0603 and then this one is like uh, 06, 03 and, and even bigger. And then it's actually like getting bigger and bigger. And for this one, you can see it's um, 10 millimeters uh, diameters here. So, so this one is uh, actually able to mount a small chip. You can use it to mount a small chip actually. Um, I, for me, I would um, probably use this one to mount those, um, um, the bigger one with, uh, for example, 20, 20 millimeters by 20 millimeters uh, chips that I can use this one. Okay. And then I actually uh, printed two 
actually printed two for this one and and the, I think the packaging is also pretty good uh, there is um, some yeah there are some forming protecting which is good and this second one I printed the second one which also looks pretty good and I printed this one specifically uh, for black color uh, that's because I want to reduce the um, um, the vision vision um, like mist detect because the dark color make it easier for the camera for the button camera to um, calibrate or to identify the the parts and of course I think here it's a bit the reflection but it's maybe it's still a little bit um, uh, wet. So I just need to maybe uh, clean it a bit and just make it dry. I think that should be that should be good. Yeah, the quality is pretty good. I'm happy with that. Then the next thing is um, um, remember I have this uh, uh, build plate, this um, base plate, um, which is. Uh, fit which fit my purpose like this one this plate uh, fits my purpose but then um, last time I built it a little bit thin here it's like uh, two millimeters here which is not um, not strong enough I would say or it's uh, likely to 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 bend a little bit so this time I want to make it a little bit stronger so I also uh, send it the um, uh, model so I want it to be a bit stronger so I also um, I also send uh, this model to the PCB way and I s I'm also quite um, interested to see how well it is because the the difficult thing about uh, this model is that it's a, it's a big um, it's like 22 by 22 millimeters and then um, yeah, it's easy to, to bend over. Okay, this is... I have to say this is really nice because last time when I, um, when I get the print from the third party, it was like, it was like burned it, bent it a little bit, so it's not like flat. But uh, this one, I think it's pretty flat. Okay, wow, that that's really good. I had to say it's a very, it's a very flat. I mean the the difficulty is like it's for this bigger parts. It's hard to get it like flat. Usually, um, you will have some some bending. You had to like later applying the the heat a little bit like uh, heat it up to um, like 50, 60 or even higher uh, temperature to get it uh, flat to the surface. But then this one, um, it's very, it's very flat. And also, I, the one I redesigned is I make this thicker. So here we, here I got three millimeters, as you can see. Then um, this is a very solid, very solid piece. Then if you do the pick and place, whatever, and if you hook up to the base, um, hook up other components on top, it will be very stable. So. Yeah, I'm amazed by the, the build quality of this um, this one. So now I will mount this uh, newly printed uh, build play into the uh, pick and place machine and uh, see how well it is.
Now, what I need to do is I need to um, uh, start the machine and then I will calibrate the device. So, let's just... Okay, so now I have already calibrated the machine and I calibrated the uh, home fiducia camera, top camera, bottom camera and now I also um, calibrate the position of the nozzle tips and I put one of the jockey nozzle head and uh, nozzle tip and the other one is the printed one. So now um, actually it's working well so I can um, actually mount the nozzle tip. So I first mount the the jockey nozzle kit, the uh, nozzle tip, as you can see, and then um, after that, I, after that I can mount the other one, which is the printed one, and you can see it's uh, picking up well and actually. Actually, I can mount it back. So in summary, this time I improved the base plate, which make it more solid. And also I uh, printed out the uh, um, new nozzle tips, which is um, uh, compatible with the jockey nozzle tip. And you can see they can um, use the same nozzle head to load it which is very handy and in all I really like the uh, print quality of this so basically the, the especially this uh, nozzle tip uh, for the small one 0201 ones which is also printed well so yeah that's uh, pretty good and um, I will keep improving the components and if you have some comments just feel free to leave in the comment area and if you like my video just uh, uh, like and subscribe and i will keep you posted yep that's all and thank you very much see you in next video